Welcome to Adventures in Geocaching with your host, You Got a Friend in PA. Hey everyone, welcome to another GeoSense Challenge. Today we're going to do something a little different. We're going to do a multi-cache. It's baseball season, so guess where we're at? We're at the ballpark. This multi-cache is four parts. And um, we're going to go see if we can find all four of them. The first part is only 128 feet away. So get ready for your GeoSense challenges that we're going to bring you. And let's see if we can find all four parts. All right. Looks like a game's ready to be started. Maybe people are starting to show up. We're going to see if we can find this cache. Straight ahead, 96 feet. All right, well, since we're close to ground zero, uh, we'll be back as soon as we find it to show you the container. All right, Robbie found stage one. It wasn't that hard. It was a micro one and a half, one and a half green bison tube. Okay, in this video frame that you're seeing now is where ground zero is. Now here comes your two locations for your GeoSense challenge. Cash location number one is this bison tube in the end of the old telephone pole as you see it here cache location number two is this green bison tube hanging in the birdhouse okay you've seen the two locations where this green bison tube could be heading now it's time to take both locations side by side one more time and show you which one's wrong and which one's actually the right location for stage one Location one is wrong. Location two is where you're gonna find this green bison tube. Cash location number two is the right one. It's inside the bird box. You gotta get some information that's on the cash page in order to figure out the combination, but it's not hard. It was easy to get into. We did it right here while we were on this while we were on site. All right, stage two of this multicast, red bison two. This one's a micro, one and a half, one and a half. Now let's show you where ground zero is. All right, in this video clip here, ground zero is, the, is in this frame. Now we're gonna give you your GeoSense challenge. Cash location number one. Is this red bison tube in the fence behind the pole, as you see here? Cash location number two, is this container behind one of these metal pieces, as you see here? All right, now for stage two, you've seen the two locations on where this red bison tube could be hitting. Now we're gonna take these and put them side by side. One is wrong, one is right. You ready? Here we go. Number one, location number one is wrong. Location number two is where this red bison tube is hitting for stage two. You have seen the two locations hope you picked the right one because it's this one right here go ahead robbie show them where this cache is this container for stage two is behind that metal piece with the stamping on it and a red bison tube in a hole very clever all right let's see if we can find stage three all right stage three is another bison tube and this one is also a micro one and a half, one and a half. All right, in this frame of the video you're watching now is where the cache is hitting and is ground zero. Now we're gonna give you the GeoSense challenge on where it, where it could be hitting. Location number one, is the bison tube hidden in this block of wood on the fence as you see here? Cache location number two. Was the red bison tube in this block of wood at the bottom of the fence pole at the ground, as you see here? All right, 
stage three. Another red bison too. You seen the two locations? Let's put them side by side. And now it's time to get rid of the wrong one and show you the right one. Location two is wrong, location one is right. The red bison tube was inside the wooden block, sitting between the fence and the fence post. All right, so far, we found stage one, we found stage two, and we found stage three. The first three stages were very easy so far. Hope you're doing good on the GeoSense challenge, because now we found the three stages. Now we need to go find the last stage. This, this multicast is a little different because this multicast does not give you coordinates from stage one to stage two to stage three. You get coordinates for stage one and then you get clues as to where it might be heading after that. So right now Robbie is going to go check to see where the sign is that we need to look for get an area of the ballpark and then we're gonna then we're gonna come out and we're gonna walk down along the fence because we know the final is that way all right in this video frame is ground zero for the final stage can you pick out where it is here comes your geosense challenge cash location number one is it the baseball bat that Robbie is holding is that the geocache final cache location number two is the log inside the green pipe that you see wired to the fence pole all right the final stage we made it now I showed you two locations one is the baseball bat two is the green pipe are you ready for the wrong one and you ready to see the right one? You think you have it figured out? Alright, well here you go. If you pick both of them, you were correct. Either one was right. Because the baseball bat is the log. And the baseball bat was inside the plastic pipe for protection. Alright everyone. You got to see the final geocache. I hope you made the right pick. It wasn't hard. If you picked the bat, you were correct. If you picked the green tube, you were correct. There was no wrong answer on this one. The baseball bat turns out that this is the actual log because that's where you put your name on. And that baseball bat is protected by the green pipe. Very clever cache. So either, there. Way, either way, you hit a home run. Yep. We're going to get the bat signed, and we're going to put it back. And then we're going to make our way back down along the fence to back to parking. All right. We take the bat. Robbie got the lid off. Slide the bat in there. Put the lid back on. And this final cache location is ready for the next seeker and the next cacher. Here's what the inside of the stadium looks like. Batting practice is going. Not that many people here yet. People, the, the teams, the second team hasn't even arrived yet. They're scared. But the geocache that you're going for is going to be up along the telephone poles here and then it goes up behind the fences up that way you don't have to walk around the whole entire thing as I thought we were gonna have to all right well we're done with this multi we're making our way back to the car we looked at the stadium a little bit nice stadium games about to start this afternoon Hopefully the rain holds out for him. It'd be nice. But this geocache is done. It's now off my list. And I hope you I hope you're able to get all four geosense challenges correct on this one.
I might have made it just a little too easy. But we're gonna go do some more caching. Maybe film another GeoSense Challenge video. But for now, we're done. Thank you for watching. And as always, happy trails, happy caching. Go get yourself a smiley. Have a good one. See you.